How to use Explain Everything. If you are in an old project when you open it, click the home icon to get back to the home screen. Once you are on the home screen, you can hit the plus in the top left corner to start a new project. You can also click on an old project that you'd started before. Then click to choose a theme to start with. Use the pen tool to draw or write. If you tap it twice, you can change its size. Tap the letter A to type words. If you double tap, you can change the font or the size. Use the plus sign to add photos, videos, sounds, math equations, or to take a new photo or video. Use the shape tool to create a new shape or line. If you double tap, you can change the shapes. Use the X tool to delete something. Tap it, then tap the object you want to delete, and then hit the X in the corner of that object. If you just drew something, the X tool turns into an eraser. You can double tap to change the size of it. If you want to point while you are recording, like I am now, hit the cursor tool. If you double tap, you can choose a different pointer. If you want to change the color of anything, double tap one of the colors to change it. You can choose from an already picked color or use the color wheel to find your own color. You can add another page by hitting the plus sign down by the slides. You can also tap slides to see all your pages or go to another one. To record, hit the red record circle. Once you hit it, the timer starts, so begin speaking right away. Make sure to stop recording when you are done speaking. Hit the red circle again to stop and finish, or you could hit the pause to take a break and begin again when you're ready. If you tap the timer after you've recorded, you can tap what you already recorded and delete part or all of it. When you are done with your project, hit the down arrow button to save it. Type a name for it, then hit save. After saving, you can always go back to it later to make changes. If you are supposed to put your project on Seesaw, hit the up arrow button to export. Tap the photos icon to save it as a photo or video for Seesaw. After it exports, you will see this. Hit OK. Then you can quit, explain everything, and open Seesaw to upload your project.